gratitude for me is about noticing the good moments or the special moments um, in each day. And it might be recognising um, kindnesses that happen. So it might be kindness from other people and from strangers, from people you know. Um, it might be the pleasant surprises that come your way that you weren't expecting, that actually you're really thankful for, that have helped you. Um, and it's really just recognising, noticing, and I guess acknowledging um, the different things each day um, in our lives that sometimes we might take for granted or we might overlook when things are a bit tricky or difficult. And I think with everything that's been going on, um, there's probably been a lot that we've realised we are grateful for and thankful for that we can give gratitude for in this what's been a really difficult time for a lot of people. But it's really helpful to practice gratitude because what can happen is we can forget and sometimes overlook the little things. And also when there are really difficult things happening in our lives, it can sometimes be really difficult to notice the little things. And actually it can be the little things that give us hope um, and can bring us a lot of joy. So a little bit about why gratitude's important um, to add to that. There's been a lot of studies that have shown that um, people who practice gratitude and acts of gratitude, they actually um, report feeling happier than people who don't. And it can show that they are more hopeful and more satisfied um, within their own lives. So the good thing is that gratitude is something that we can practice and something that we can learn. So that when we practice it, it can almost like become a bit of a mindset. Um, and when we practice that, it almost gets a little bit more hardwired into our brain to kind of look for the positive things and to appreciate the little things. And once we can do that, that almost gives us like a superpower um, in life, a little bit more of resilience um, to overcome things when we might be having a tricky day, um, just to notice those positives and to feel more hopeful. Okay, so some ways that you can practice gratitude. So one of my favourite ones is the gratitude jar. So this is my gratitude jar here. And um, this is really good for practising gratitude. So you can just get like an old jam jar or anything like that, like this. I think this was like a um, beetroot jar or something. And you can clean it out and then each day you can, um, I use post-it notes, but you can get coloured bits of paper or just ordinary bits of paper. And you can write something that you notice you are grateful for each day and pop them in the jar. And it's quite a nice activity to do um, with a family. So if you want to open that up maybe once a month or once a week, um, look at them, look at all of your memories and your experiences and chat to each other about what particularly you've been um, pleased about or happy about or what has helped you over that time. Okay, so I'm gonna have a look at mine now see what type of things I've put down over the past couple of weeks. Okay, cuddles with my dog and cat. Uh, music that makes me want to dance. That's something that gives me a lot of joy. Um, I watched an amazing film last night called A Beautiful Day in the Neighbourhood and it was a really positive film and it was really uplifting and that made me feel really good and I just felt really grateful that someone had made that film and I got to watch it. And I'll do one last one. My friend visited me this week and we had um, a social distancing catch up in my garden and she made me laugh a lot. So I'm really grateful for that. Grateful for laughter and grateful for friends. What you can do is um, we've got lots of resources that we've created and put on our website of ways that you can practice gratitude. And one of the ways um, when things might feel tricky is to tune into your senses. So to notice and think back, what have I experienced through, um, what have I seen, what have I smelled, what have I tasted, what have I touched or felt, or what have I heard in the past um, week or the past 24 hours that I have enjoyed or that has helped me, what can I feel thankful for? Thank you very much for watching.